This is Leah Garvey and welcome back to my travel update to the Philippines. We have a new travel update from the Bureau of Immigration which had been released around 12 o'clock Philippine time. Um, Bureau of Immigration Guide on Travel Restrictions still be Filipino citizen or dual um, citizen. Balik Bayan, which are former Filipinos returning uh, back to the Philippines and foreign nationals with a valid and existing visa. So this is the most impo important one at the moment are foreign nationals, a valid visa and ACRI card. Those holding 9A visa need to present an entry exemption documents from the country's foreign posts abroad. So the only one that um, had changed uh, at the moment for foreign nationals are the one holding special residence retirees visa um, shall be allowed to enter the country without need of an entry exemption documents. So that is the only one um, that has changes so far. So if you're holding, if you're holding 9A visa, you will still need to contact the Department of Foreign Affairs, um, Philippine Department of Foreign Affairs, to apply for an exemption to enter the Philippines. So if you're holding a, a special resident retirees visa, then you don't need the exemption. And that is from the IATF guys the interagency task force, um, the one who um, released that uh, information for the uh, foreign nationals holding special retirees visa. Anyway, we have um, also in here, um, there's a lot going on about um, a vaccination. I'm just gonna read this one, guys. The recommendation of the IATF technical working group are approved the specifics of which are as follows. Okay, I'm just going to focus on number two guys. Notwithstanding the provisions of the omnibus guidelines on the, on the implementations of community quarantine in the Philippines, the inbound international travel to any port of the Philippines of all fully vaccinated individuals who have been vaccinated in the Philippines shall be governed by the following guidelines. So take note guys, this only applies for people who are vaccinated in the Philippines that are coming back to the Philippines. All arriving Fully vaccinated individuals shall be required to undergo a seven-day facility-based quarantine upon arrival with the day of arrival being the first day. So this one, guys, this doesn't apply to everyone. So the seven-day only applies to Filipinos or anyone who been vaccinated in the Philippines. You will be quarantined only seven days so it doesn't apply to anyone that has not been vaccinated in the Philippines so if you're traveling from Australia America Europe even you have the best vaccine um, and fully vaccinated you will you can't avail the seven days you have to be quarantined 10 days because this only applies to um, people who had been vaccinated in the Philippines okay upon completion of the seven-day facility-based quarantine the Bureau of quarantine shall issue a quarantine certificate in indicating therein the individual's vaccination status um, so there we are guys so that's what we have for today, guys, from the Bureau of Immigration and also from the IATF, Interagency Task Force. Um, I'll let you make a comment what you think about this. Um, 
yeah it would be nice guys if you do so um comment below uh so that we can you can also share with other people what you think about this um new laws and yeah so it's still um i don't know <laughs> it's hard to say um yeah speechless I'm just gonna sing that speechless song uh yeah anyway guys i did upload a video a few hours ago um about trying to contact um philippine consulate general and the embassy here in australia we live in a smaller town here in queensland so it's a bit it's a bit difficult for us to just walk in and see the Philippine Consulate General um, it will take us the nearest one is in Brisbane which will take us two hours flight to Brisbane so we can't just walk in and you know ask so which makes it difficult so that's all for now guys it would be nice if they include you know they, they it would be nice if they will make considerations for other countries um, to have exemption also you know uh, about this quarantine um, it's not just vaccinated in the Philippines um, I don't really want to say much um, why they decided this uh, seven day quarantine might as well make it ten days <laughs> anyway guys I try not to I try not to say negative things guys I know a lot of people a lot of you a lot of people get frustrated um, I'll just try not to get because the world is already shit oh, I shouldn't say that <laughs> let's just try to calm down I know it's anyway thank you so much guys for watching we just hope they will have good news um, I've been reading a lot of comments in their Facebook page a lot of people not happy you know I can understand anyway hope you like this video guys if you do please give us a like and don't forget to leave a comment below and if you haven't subscribed to my channel guys don't forget to click that red button down below please and don't forget to click that bell button next to it so that you don't miss my next vlog thank you so much guys for watching once again this is Dia Garvey and hope you all safe and I'll see you in my next vlog thanks for watching bye bye